Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, and we have the biggest toy haul in the history of toy hauls. A lot of this stuff I got on the 15th and other days of this month. An entire toy haul of toys through the 15th and onwards. Almost. We have a total of 60... Sixty-five bucks worth of toys in this entire toy haul. So, a lot of this stuff I got at other times. A lot of this stuff is pretty cool. We're going to show off everything we got. We'll start on the stuff on the top. This is the stuff I, some of the stuff I got from the St. Angeles Flea Market. This is the Rescue Bots Big Scale Optimus Prime with trailer and we will be reviewing this on my channel and it is 100 percent complete so yeah that's the best looking optimus prime i've ever gotten and it connects like real simply so yeah i do like this optimus prime in general so everything we're going to show off, we're going to have to move on to the side. Transformers and some noise-making toys. We got this walk-in robot that looks like it'd be a, a car bot. But it walks on its own. It doesn't transform. He's got this big double-barrel cannon arm and this fist. So you can go fist in some guys. He it looks like his eyes still light up, so that's pretty cool. He still lights up somewhat, but not as good as when he probably first was found before I found him. But we also got some, that was one of my toy hauls from the Goodwill outlet. Here's another one that I love so much. I'm going to turn him on. Yeah, his head likes to do that. But yeah, this is a this is a noise making Ninja Turtle big scale. That's one of the big items on my toy haul, so we're gonna turn him off to save his batteries for when I do review him. But yeah, we got some turtle stuff as well and some Marvel. We got this Iron Man noise making motorcycle. And he lights up. Yeah, that's awesome. Coolest looking Iron Man motorcycle I ever bought. And it makes noise. This is staying a part of my Iron Man collection. It's so cool, right? Love it. We got this Moon Rover. I got this for free. And I just put my Ryan's World Astronaut in it. So we got a moon rover. When you press the button, it becomes a solar dish moon rover with a satellite dish. And that's pretty cool. I will review that indefinitely. We're going to put everything off this side we got in this big toy haul. Next, we got a Spider-Man. Another Spider-Man 12-inch, but we let him get venomized by Venom. So he's been venomized. By a Venom symbiote and took it over. This can go on any figure. But I decided to use this one because it works. I don't mind owning another one if I have this stuff on it. It's pretty cool. And I got that from the Goodwill outlet. With a lot of stuff for 60 bucks. We got a robot dog. Cool noise making robot dog. I love it. At the Goodwill outlet, we found a Cyberverse Deluxe Class Bumblebee. This figure is valued at 20 bucks, and I got him for no money down for 60 bucks. For under 60 bucks. No more, 
no less. And this guy is complete, basically complete. Even his vehicle mode. First transformer I got from them that is 100% complete. That's nice. We got Steve's girlfriend from Minecraft, and this is a figure of her. I don't know her name. If any of you know Minecraft and know her name, then I'd like to know her name for sure. Have to just put the stuff I show off on the floor. We got a mermaid action figure. This is a detailed action figure with some movement and articulation. I picked this up at the Goodwill outlet for 60 bucks, along with this figure. This little, my little pony, little tentacle one, it's kind of scary in a sense. So I am picking up MLP. We got another Pinkie Pie, because Pinkie Pie is cute and I do like Pinkie Pie. We got a Hero Mashers, Darth Vader. I sense a disturbance in the Force. That'll be something reviewed with all the Star Wars stuff I found. Another thing on the Goodwill Outlet, we got the Hulk. Hulk Smash! Dorothy from The Wizard of Oz. Pongo from the movie 101 Dalmatians. This is an action figure of Pongo. I don't have a figure of him. But I loved that movie when I was growing up. The Last Night Legends Optimus Prime. Not a bad find, if I do say so myself. The guy from Pocahontas. I don't know his name, but he was saved. Okay. A cop action figure. My duty is to serve and protect. That's my best cop impression. My duty is to serve and protect. We got another one of these dino little transforming eggs. So it's a pterodactyl. So I got two of them. We got a Treasure X dinosaur. Dig that. This is one figure I picked up personally today because she was a cutie. And I love picking up some cute Cutie Girls, and this is from a series called Rainbow High. I don't know her name, but she is just so cute, and she'll be going on my random figure collection. She is so cute and adorable, and she's got a lot of articulation. Like, hello, world. Yep. All right. Transformers Prime Optimus Prime. Transform and roll out. It's my Optimus Prime impression. We got these astronaut figures. I love these. So, yeah. We got this girl. She's from a Disney movie. I don't know which one, but she's a good one. Oh, we got Mickey Mouse and a Peter Pan mini Funko. And he's a Mickey Mouse like Uncle Sam Mickey Mouse. A lot of Transformers. This is not a Decepticon, but it is a VTech figure that actually transforms. Flip it on. Ready to roll. Get in gear. I'm gonna redline that engine. Bring the boom. What are you waiting for? Let's roll. I like this because it makes noise. One of my favorite finds at the thrift store. Owen Grady from Jurassic World. And I got blue as well. But this Owen Grady is going on this motorcycle when I review him. So he's got a motorcycle like he did in the movie. Like, I'm going after blue with my cool looking motorcycle. Vroom vroom. That was a nice find. Transformers Prime, Bumblebee. I don't know how to make his beeping noise. A fast food toy, Storm Shadow. I like Storm Shadow. He's one of my favorite Cobra guys. Next on the list, we got another thing I got from the flea market. 
It's a little Imagine X figure. Cool. Car looks like a Batmobile. Goodwill outlet. <laughs> Probably gonna have to keep a bin bin around for the smalls. I'm gonna get a container for the smalls. Put them in the smalls container. Anything smalls will be left in the smalls container for when I do review them. So right now I'm throwing them in a metal container for smalls. But I did find a G.I. Joe comic book at the Goodwill outlet. I'm not going to bother showing that off, but that is pretty cool. But yeah, a lot of cool figures at so many good epic flea markets. I won't tell you how many things I went to. I went to yard sales, flea markets. I went to two yard sales and got a cool freebies. And this is another dinosaur that I like so much. And I got this for free. Man, this guy looks pretty terrifying. I found two dinosaurs this month alone. Three dinosaurs this month alone, like three or four this month alone. And of course, I finally got a rise of the Ninja Turtles, Leonardo. Yes, I almost got the whole set of these guys. I need to get their weapons. These guys are mostly complete, except I need their weapons. So some epic freebie, some epic good figures. Bunch of these Imagine X figures. Probably going to use for my Gotham City display or Lord of the Rings. Another figure we got at the Goody Will. I do like these anime, these girls from Equestria, like they're anime girls with little ears and wings. I love that. It's kind of a cool series if I do say so myself. <laughs> we got Mulan without the armor. I like that movie Milan when I was growing up. A Transformers one step changer, Bumblebee. Love that. What else we got? We got a complete rocket raccoon with a big blaster. Oh yeah. I love some epic marble. I found so much epic marble. I love finding marble. And Rocket Raccoon is bad to the bone with that big gun of blaster power. That's what I love about Rocket. He's a fun character from Marvel. Another, another Disney doll, I think. But she is cute enough that I'm going to keep her in my collection. I like to find cuties. <laughs> I like robots. I like cute girl action figures that are adorable. We got this robot pirate. Beep boop. Arg. I love figures. We got another version of Scooby Doo Shaggy. I love finding Scooby Doo figures. I got that from the Goodwill outlet as well. Along with this guy, he looks like Harry Potter in his regular clothes, so he's going to be on my Hogwarts display for sure when I review him. Ooh. Man, we got quite a bit of good stuff here. We got this uh, Bowser from the Goodwill Outlet. I love finding Mario. I found him and Yoshi when I was there. Along with this cool looking light up zombie thing. I might throw that in a review, because this is just so cool looking. Look at that, those eyes, they're terrifying. Like, he's gonna eat your brains. I'll eat your brains. Another thing from my Lion King collection, we got Simba all grown up. Definitely keeping that for sure. We got this, this guy. He's kind of creepy, he's like a old snowman guy. Love that. And he's got a little ball and chain. That's scary. Keeping that for my personal collection. What else? Here's another one I got for free. I didn't get this for free, but I found this at the Goodwill outlet. It's 
None other than Star Wars Black Series Lando Calrissian. I have never had a figure of him, and I'm so glad to add one to my Star Wars collection. Because I love Star Wars. As many of you know, I grew up with Star Wars Episode 1, 2, and 3. And later on, I watched Episodes 4, 5, and 6. Which made perfect sense. But here's another Mario character. It's Yoshi! I liked Yoshi. I like Yoshi. And we got one of my Spider-Man in his spider car. And I got this from the flea market for only four bucks with a bunch of other figures. You're going to see a lot of stuff from that in this. And probably in the other boxes as well. We got bins and boxes of good scores. We got this little knockoff Barbie girl. I don't know anything about her. But yeah, she was just cute, cute. I got her for by the pound. This is one vintage figure. Many of you may not remember, but this was a series where the kids were trying to get out of, out of school. It was called Recess. A vintage Disney cartoon that I still love to this day. I love finding a figure of her. Okay, next figure we got is this cool looking, like, little knockoff Barbie, but she's wearing some, an outfit that would go well on a horse, like, giddy up horsey, like one of those hunter girls, I do like that. Speaking of Jurassic World or Jurassic Park, we got this dinosaur. I think it might be from Jurassic Park, but I got to replace the batteries on this thing because it takes a different type of batteries. I got to get some LR44s for this thing. Once it's complete, it'll be worth it. A lot of epic scores, if I do say so myself. Another R2-D2. I love Star Wars R2-D2. Yeah, we're going through a lot of toys here. Another thing I got for the flea market. This was a quarter. It's like another jaw shark, and the mouth moves. Look at that. Brr, I'll eat you. Brr. Love that. Oh, yeah. Another thing I got from the Goodwill outlet, it's that scary bus. I like that from Cars. I really do. Okay. Through all the good stuff so far, Minecraft bear. Brr, I'm a big scary bear. Brr. And a vintage Sonic the Hedgehog 2 toy with the stand. I found two like that. See? We got that one in Eggman mech suit here. Going, I might review those on the channel. Who knows? I'm going to keep looking. But this is the brand new item. Slightly brand new. This model kit was assembled in the box, and it's a knight on horseback. And I did like some medieval horses, and this is definitely going to be a part of my medieval collection of Lord of the Rings lore. I love that. Going to look forward to reviewing that and displaying that. Another MLP I found. Rainbow Dash. Never go wrong with Rainbow Dash. And BB-8, love that figure. I love BB-8's little ball thing. Of course, another Batman. I am the knight. I am Batman. I do a mean Batman impression. This is a guy from Overwatch, and it's a little figure. I love that. Another dog from Paw Patrol. I like the cute dogs. I collect cute dogs. I think they're adorable. Goodwill Outlet, this Toad car, Goodwill Outlet, this one, the flea market, the Goodwill Outlet flea market, the, not Goodwill Outlet flea market, what used to be St. Angela's, I had to correct myself, this is St. Angela's fine, I got for a quarter, it's a Toy Story figure of the uh, guy from Toy Story that was the uh, 
Canadian jumper guy. We got this knockoff pirate I got from a, for a quarter at the Goodwill Outlet. Arr, shimmy Tim. Not from Goodwill Outlet, but from the flea market. Arr, shimmy Timbers. I'll make you walk the plank, matey. So he is an epic find. Another Cars car. I love this design. Love those designs. And this I got for free. It's of my first deluxe class wrestler. Let's get ready to pound you in the next week. Oh, yeah. I don't know his name. I don't tend to know all my wrestlers here. Another thing I got from the church flea market. And it's a bat boat. And I threw a Batman figure I have extra on it. Keeping that in my personal Batman collection. For sure. We're getting through quite a bit here. We got an incomplete. I got from the church flea market. And it's the Transformers Ultra B combiner. He's missing his arm and the drift sword. So he's incomplete. Alright. What else we got here? Got this little diver dude. Little short dude. Like him. Of course, the Joker. Love the Joker from Batman. Yep. Stuff are some epic toys. Another one of those little Barbie figure knockoffs. This cool car with a cannon. It's got a cannon on it. And I think a little dinosaur on it. I love that. Gonna keep that. I got that at the Good Outlet. This guy I got at the uh, Church Flea Market quarter. Little construction worker. Like that. From the Church Flea Market. The other thing I got at the Church Flea Market, we got some vintage. Retro vintage 1980s. Generation 1. Autobot Gears. He will be reviewed here on the channel. And this I got at a... A yard sale in my neighborhood for 50 cents. A Mighty Morphin Power Rangers figure from the 90s. The original version anyway. Not the uh, Retromorph one. Epic fine. And these are Super Wings. They're kind of like Transformers. So I will be reviewing those too. I was at Church Flea Market for a quarter, along with Transformers Rescue Bots, Chase. So I got a figure of Chase here. In car form, finally. 25 cents. Not bad for under four bucks. This I got for 50 cents at another yard sale, and it's Captain America, but he's missing his shield. I'll still review them, but I'll have to track down his shield or get a complete figure and just donate them or resell them. I'll see how it goes. This I got for free, and it's a little car with eyes. Oh, that's cute. Keeping that for sure. Yeah, a lot of epic scores here. We got Donald Duck, Disney action figure. I love finding some Disney poseable action figures. The Human Torch from Fantastic Four, I got him for a quarter. So I got almost the whole Fantastic Four figure line, except for the Human Torch. He is the last one I need to complete my Fantastic Four collection. I'll probably get Doctor Doom and the Silver Surfer. Another thing I got for free... A car that lights up and makes noise when you press the button. So no nothing better than free, I'll tell you that. Another thing I got from the Goodwill outlet. It's R2-D2. His head spins and makes noise. I love that. Keeping that. For sure. Okay. Through the figures I got. Another figure I got from the church flea market. It's Bruce Wayne. Love that. Okay. 
This is the Ryan's World Dragon Knight figure. The only reason I got it was because it's a dragon. It's a little knight dragon. It reminds me of Aragon. I love that. It's going to be reviewed and put on my dinosaur shelf. And it makes noise, so I'm keeping that for sure. Another thing I got from the church flea market, my first Avatar figure. It's Jake Selly. Yep. Keeping him in my random figure collection. I got him for a quarter at the church flea market. Church flea market. It's Superman. Imagine X figure. Okay. Getting through a lot of the church flea market stuff. Another freebie. It's a little knockoff Barbie. So I did get quite a few of those. Next, we got from the Goodwill Outlet, it's Mulan in armor, ready for battle to defend China. And she is cute, and I'm keeping her in my collection. I always like the classic Disney characters. And speaking of Disney characters, we got Jim Hawkins from Disney's Treasure Planet. Awesome, right? Keeping him for sure. When I get done, I'll have to throw everything back in here. Okay. Another thing I got from the church flea market for a quarter. It's another Imagine X figure. And I think I got some gear for them. I got from the Goodwill outlet. Let's try and find that gear stuff. Uh, there we go. He's got some gear of sorts. Oh, wait, it doesn't fit. Hmm. Gotta have a helmet for him. Where's that helmet I found? I got a helmet in here too, somewhere. Part of Grimlock's foot for that combiner. Okay, born here from the church flea market. <laughs> I think we got through most everything with the church flea market, except for these two figures. We got Lex Luthor and my first posable Aladdin figure. I'd love to get Jasmine for my collection because she's cute looking. Why not? So a lot of stuff of, of great finds from here. This I got from the flea market up in the Goodwill outlet area by Walmart and this is 2017 movie brawl from the both Revenge of the Fallen and 2016 movie Tank Brawl and this is 100% complete and I will review this before I go to Steel City Con so stay tuned when we review this mean looking Decepticon because he's awesome in general. Okay. We got Pluto and Ariel from Disney. Because I like some classic Disney character action figures. They have articulation. I keep them. They don't. I don't bother keeping them. We got the Prince from Ariel, forget his name. Some wind ups for my wind up collection. I got a little baseball player and a little skeleton. That's why I picked these up. They were so cool. I got them at the Goodwill outlet. Another freebie I did get. It's another transforming dino. It's a Pachasaurus. Keeping that. And we got from the Goodwill outlet. Look at this robot dinosaur. Rawr, rawr. I'll eat you. Munch, munch. Okay, from the Goodwill Outlet, we got Owen Grady and some Jurassic World security guy. So I got some Jurassic Park stuff as well. So yeah, this piece can go on him and cover up his face if you want it to. And he's got some armor. 
secure area secured. Move on. Because he's cool, for sure. So a lot of epic action figures of epicness, if I do so myself. We got, uh, that's something that's going on my Marvel shelf for random. You'll see that off my toy collection review. We got Mater from Cars, another Mater. Never go wrong with Mater. I like his goofy truck self. We got a Green Lantern mini action figure. That's adorable. RC from Toy Story. Love that. Those came from the Goodwill Outlet along with these. Mini display figure Bionicles from Web of Shadows. That's nice. We got the guy from Lion King. So we only need, need the other guy. And we'll have the whole Lion King team back together. We got a another Spider-Man. This is a 